Here we go. Goodbye, Bohemia. I'm sad already. All right, I'm racking my brains. I can't think of anything else we've got to prepare. I think she's good to go, or rather we are. She's all tapped up, locked up. So hopefully we're not gonna come back to a mole disaster. So it's a bit of a mission getting out of this marina. We need to take a water taxi to town, to Bocas del Toro. Then from there, we're gonna take the small aircraft to Panama City. And then from Panama City, we fly to Houston, Texas. And then from Houston, Texas to England, London. So um, today is Tuesday morning and we're gonna get to London on Thursday. Yay! And who says that sailing is slow way of traveling, eh? <laughs> yeah, isn't it nice to be in these lovely remote places? Well, yes it is, until you have to leave. <laughs> First leg of the journey, eh? Last goodbye to Bohemia. Well, we didn't make it too far. I'd say about 20 meters from the ferry stop. We thought we needed a little celebration after our couple of days of hard work shutting Bohemia down. You know, when in Panama, you got to drink Panama and first leg of the journey is done, we deserve it. Gonna calm our nerves from the separation anxiety. This is leg two of our big journey. We're off to Texas. Uh, it's been like a 3 a.m. start, so hopefully it doesn't show too much. Uh, but we are off to get our cowboy boots and our big hats on. First mates always wanted some of those. Uh, one more leg to go after that, and then we'll be home. Uh, but still life in the fast lane compared to sailing. Well, here we are in Texas. And you know what they say, everything is bigger here. So let's go and find it. Maybe we find a bigger boat. <laughs> That's right. That's why we're here. <laughs> well, here we are, settled right back into life in the USA. Can you tell? <laughs> Grande. <laughs> because size matters. Because he's worth it or something. And size matters. Uh, it's been a really smooth journey so far, if a little long and drawn out. Uh, but the first flight went really well. Second flight also went really well and no one's battered an eyelid at the really suspicious big flashy EPIRB that I've got in my bag with the antenna that just like pops up as soon as I get it out for uh, TSA officials. Uh, but no, it's all really good. Despite my stresses, everyone's been really chilled out about it. Including me. This is the last flight. Cannot wait. <laughs> Only 16 more hours to go and we should be home. First mates promised to keep the entertainment coming all the way, so we're not gonna get bored. I'm gonna be like that child you don't want to sit next to on the aircraft. <laughs> I've rehearsed. Watch this space. What he doesn't know is he's not gonna sit next to me. I already logged in and changed my seats. <laughs> Someone else's problem now. Well, how exciting. We've been in London a few days already and we're about to head off out of town on a road trip. Uh, we're gonna meet a couple of our fans from YouTube and patrons uh, who we've never met before. We're really looking forward to it. Well, I'm ready. Wales is waiting. Really is the Kraken. You know, just the essentials. New limes, four bottles of Kraken, off we go. I knew I shouldn't have left packing to the first mate. Who knows what we're wearing? 
can't arrive empty handed can we? But at least we'll be well hydrated. Alright, you know where we're going? West. <laughs> as far as west goes. <laughs> to the end of the road. We got a good forecast. Should be there in no time. The wind is blowing 25 knots, powering us forward like there is no tomorrow. Life in the fast lane. We arrived in Milford Haven to meet our wonderful patrons, Dave and Nick, who didn't waste any time in taking us to the local marina for a special treat. Oh, look at that. Back by the seaside already. This is gorgeous. There you go. Two captains, two first mates. We're gonna hit the sea. Oh, is that it? The beach. Look at that. So Captain Dave just got his big rib with 90 horsepower engine yesterday. So this is gonna be the test run. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> I'm so excited to be back on the water and in a fast boat. This should be a lot of fun. How do you like Bohemia's new dinghy? <laughs> Just need to get it back now. It's an easy journey, just across the Atlantic to Panama. We should make it in eight days. We'll fill up before we leave. It started. And it's on camera. <laughs> Don't worry, Dave, I am an amazing editor. Yeah. He makes even my docking look natural. <laughs> Huh? It's such a pop one. Can I get this one? Yeah, we'll probably... Don't expect me to do anything. Bobby. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not right, Dominique. Okay. okay. Jump. Little one hopping on. Oh. Oh. Oh, I've got a twitch. <laughs> <laughs> so. And the moment he says yee-haw, you will see me hit them. Four <laughs> yee-haws allowed on boat. <laughs> The last he hide and he threw his uh, mate too hard and shot time into the water. And we lost the chemo that. <laughs> Welcome to Costa de Milford. Panama, eat your heart out. It's just tropical. The action shots here. <laughs> the Holly Murders on Cold Island. Docking, docking, coming in hot. No, 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 no. Oh, I, I, yeah. Wow. Cheers for the captain. <laughs> oh, this is the British weather at its best, isn't it? Don't know what he's talking about. It's a normal sunny day in the UK. It's always like this. Do you want a sunshine? Come to Wales. I think it's colder in Panama right now. I can't believe it, we are being really spoiled with the boys. 
Can you believe it? This is the first time we've ever boated in the UK and it hasn't disappointed. So any more friends in the UK who's got a boat, let us know. <laughs> Cheers. 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 Oh, salvation. Yeah. <laughs> well, what a wonderful time we had with the boys in Milford Haven. Uh, it's my first time uh, in the far west of Wales, certainly to Milford Haven and it's a beautiful place. I'm so glad that we managed to uh, hang out with the boys and meet them. Dave and Nick are such wonderful, warm, welcoming, genuine people. And uh, I feel like we've met half their family as well. Uh, we hung out a little bit with uh, Anna and uh, Dave's mother, uh, met Dave's dogs, met Dave's uncle and aunt. Uh, Dave's uncle is building a boat as well. He's built, this is his third one. He's got another one on the go. Uh, really, really lovely, inspirational people. Uh, Dave and Nick spoiled as rotten as well. Uh, they rented a gorgeous little cottage with a hot tub um, and we hang out there dr with some drinks in the evening. They surprised us with a welcome hamper full of local Welsh goodies uh, on arrival. So we've got our Welsh cakes uh, we've got our local Welsh whiskey to, to drink when we're in Staffordshire. Uh, it's wonderful. We also went out in the harbour and spent a whole day and a half uh, on their brand new super fast speedy uh, rib uh, inflatable boat. I think we managed about 35 knots yesterday. So how do you like life in the fast lane? Good for my ring cup! <laughs> and good for my hair! <laughs> you don't have to think about tide or journey time. They're just there at the pub. That's where we're headed. And of course, the uh, the captain here got to have a little drive, so it was so much fun. Uh, it's actually really both of our first time on the water in the UK, uh, rather embarrassingly coming from here. Uh, we only got into boating when we moved to California, so uh, it just reminded us how much natural beauty is here on the doorstep and hopefully one day we want to sail these waters as well. Uh, yeah, just wonderful. It was only two short days hanging out with Dave and Nick, but uh, we really hope to see them again soon. And uh, of course, we told them they're always welcome to come see us in Panama or wherever Bohemia happens to be at the time. And now we're off to the next adventure. We're off to see my mother in the Midlands. That's right, going to the mother-in-law. I'm laced with Valium. I'm ready. Yeah, her too. <laughs> it's gonna be fun. Oh, ye pass. <laughs> like ye pass. Okay, am I past the uh, speed limit? Uh, just the yellow boy there. Let's go. Have you drink ribs before? No. no. Okay. <laughs> right, I Give him a lesson. On that. Yeah. And if you feel down to the right now. Let's put that up. Oh my god. Right. Feel the button. Aaron. That was easy. It's in my blood, my genes. Now for the hard part. What knots he gonna do? Yeah. Three round turns and pray to all your gods. That's the one. <laughs> it's not my boat, yeah. <laughs> Special thanks in this episode go to Dave and Nick for putting up with us in real life and showing us around sunny Milford Haven. Thank you also to our latest patrons, Lou and Bob from Florida, who love sailing their 22-foot sailboats. Thank you to Dell, Rick, Ricardo and Zane 
crew of SV Bear Paw from Texas, and thank you to Jimmy. Jimmy, I'm sorry we don't know where you're from, but thank you all so much, and here's to you. Champagne for everyone. <laughs>